we are uh, not just on planet Earth, we are planet Earth. Either <laughs> you get it now or you will get it when you're buried. There is no choice whether to be this earth or no, we are this earth. But the choice is either to consciously live that or one day we will have to learn lessons from the maggots. <laughs> I think as human beings, as the peak of evolution and intelligence on this planet, I think we should realize this by ourselves. Maggots should not be our teachers, <laughs> but if only, if only every moment of your life you were conscious that you are the very earth that you walk upon. Just a little prancing that you can do does not separate you from the earth. You are the earth. If all of us are conscious of this, there's really no problem. Everything that needs to be done, compensatory activity that needs to be done for whatever that has happened could be done without much struggle. Above all, this whole struggle that a whole lot of people are going through psychologically of loneliness, of uh, incoherence with life, kind of dislocated within themselves, all this will completely go away. You will have a certain earthy sense of wholeness. You must know this. You must live here like the very soil that you walk upon. Well, this is not a teaching. This is a fact that you are the soil. Get it now, don't wait ah, for that day when other people will put you in the soil. We are the soil. Soil is the food, soil is our body. Everything that we call as ourselves is what we have imbibed and accumulated from this planet. Let's use this well, take this to the highest possibility and put it back into the earth when it's time.